Hey guys, how's it going? This is Nat Nader. Welcome back to Rule of Rose. So I'm carrying on right from last time, and I plan to find Martha's hat. Not Martha's hat, that's a fucking dirty rag, I'm an idiot. Go! Let's do it, Brown. You and me. So, we are back, it is a new episode, and there goes uh, something that was too dark to see. So, in that case, we will ignore it as if it never happened, and we shall continue to look for the dirty rag. Alright, Brown, what do you see? Oh, this way, alright. I was expecting it to be a bit closer, but that's alright. Look at this. This is awesome. Brown is awesome, damn it. Like, imagine if I had to find all these things myself. Not happening. This is like a free walkthrough. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Brown. You're better than a walkthrough. You're my friend. What is this camera angle? Here? I trust you. Let's go. Don't mind me, people. I'm just walking around with a knife. <gasps> I knew it! I knew there was something back there. <laughs> Trying to hide from me. Three leaf key. I should have just cut it down with the fork like last time. Thank you, Brown. You saved me the trouble of having to cut through it myself. Come. So, you follow me. We're gonna go and get that three-leaf door open. We're gonna learn all the secrets. Nothing that will escape my glare. Hmm. I wonder what's gonna be behind that door. I'm very interested. So it's up the stairs. I'm slowly, like, becoming accustomed to where I have to go now. What is Brown doing? He was just standing behind there. But now he's beside me, so that's fine. Number three. Oh. Alright. Oh shit, I'm running out of space again. I wonder what I should throw away next. So... I guess since I've got the knife now, I can drop the fork. I don't think I'm going to need it to use the scissors again. I'll throw away Martha's hat. I don't even care about her anyway. I don't think I need the keys previous anymore. So now I have more space. And I freaking closed the menu, damn it. I still needed to use this. Boom. We're in, boy. Okay. Um, now, where... Alright, we've still got the dirty rag on hold. Go! Oh, wait, no, no. It's not the dirty rag anymore, is it? Screw it. Let's just put the biscuit tin up. I want more biscuits. Go! Ah. Woohoo! Biscuit time! Take me to the biscuits. Alright. Nice. Good job, Brown. Any more? No, that's okay. I don't expect you to always find biscuits, boy. Alright, so... Now I've got to find a door which stands out from the rest. One which might be interesting to go into. This is that. Right. <clears throat> These doors are all looking pretty... pretty bland. Meh. I may as well just try all of them in the end. Is this like the cabin's quarters or something? There's like names on all of them. There's Nic Nicola. This one is... Leo. It's like Leo from 
Twin Peaks. He's the craziest. Ooh, what's this? Now this is a door that looks different from the rest. <laughs> hmm. Oh, she has a butterfly. We're gonna steal it, aren't we? Oh yeah, we're gonna steal it. I just gotta figure out how. Oh, okay. So this is this area. Right, right. So that's why she was creeping around like a pedo before. Right. So what what am I gonna do about that, I wonder? Um I'm not sure if there's anything I can do about that. If she's just hanging out in there. What am I what am I gonna have to do? Wendy. Not Wendy! Uh, not Victor, unfortunately. Excuse me for the yawning. What name's that? Buas or Vars? That's Thomas. Why the... Whoa, 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 calm down. What's that? Oh, okay, no smoking. Well, wasn't planning on it, friends. Wasn't planning on it. Now... Oh, okay. Well, I was gonna say, like, I was gonna say, where the hell? Wait, what? Um, um, hello? I'm gonna shank you. Look, I stabbed her head. She should be dead now. All right, let's talk to her. Come on. Wait, what? Are you all right? The unlucky girl met Amanda, the small-hearted princess. The princess's round face loomed large as she spoke to the girl. Hmm, loomed large indeed. Oh, what the fuck, what a gross bitch, alright. I found this butterfly. It's mine, I won't give it to you. I won't lose to you. Well, what happens if I threaten you? I can cut you, you know. Ciao. You dirty newcomer. Out with you. Alright. Well, she's having none of our shit, so... We have no business here, Brown. Let's leave. What's up with that? <laughs> oh. <laughs> what, are you alright there? Jesus Christ. That's fucked. She's done. She's fucking... She's a done dinner. Where the fuck did she go? Maybe I should have followed her. She came up here, right? Wait, what the fuck? Something fell over down here. Come. I saw that. I don't know what to do about it, though. Okay, whatever. Sorry, I was just listening for a second. I thought I heard her walking around. I think it was just brown, though. Like, what the hell was up with that? Where did she go? Hmm. Can I make brown find the butterfly and make him find her one? Oh. Hang on a minute. Wait, back in here? Did she put it back? What do you smell, Brown? Oh, what's here? An empty insect case in which a butterfly used to be displayed. I found the butterfly case. Okay. Oh, okay. In that case, now that I have the case, I can make him find that. We're gonna go hunt that bitch down. Let's go. 
Come on, Brown. Let's get him. You and me. Let's do this. I wonder where she got to. She's obviously not left this area. Wow, I thought that she would have left. This way? Okay. <gasps> Quick! Jennifer! What are you doing? Don't watch it go! Don't! You just... You let it go, Jennifer. Jennifer, what are you doing? Wait, there's two now? What's up with that? There's four now. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> there's, um... I would assume there's eight, on, and now sixteen. And... And thirty-two in here. Let's go. That's strange, man. That's very strange. Maybe she should have just saved herself the trouble and gotten it when it was there. <gasps> Quick! The girl found a beautiful blue butterfly. Quick, before anyone else gets it, Jennifer, this butterfly would surely make a satisfactory gift. Jesus fucking Christ, all she needs to do is catch it and take it to the gift box. Hopefully, no one else gets it. Oh no. Ooh. Place waste paper in the rubbish bin and laundry in the filth room. Stray dogs gives us sweets. Stray dog kidnaps kids. Stray dog comes at night. Children who don't clean up will be punished. Hello, boys and girls. It's time for some cleaning. Oh, here we go. They're the ones that got Martha. Holy shit, they're everywhere. Jesus. Oh, yeah? You want a tango with me? Ha! Ah. I got a fucking knife, bitch. I'll slice you down. Let's try a little fucking ass. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh, yeah. Get juked. Oh, shit. Trying to be smart at me? I'll stab a bitch. You, you stay there, Brown. I will take care of this. Stop hitting me with your stupid brooms. Maybe I should pick up that butterfly. I should probably grab it just in case. I found the blue butterfly. It's very beautiful. Indeed it is. I wonder if I could just leave this area. Oops. Can I close this door? No. I had a feeling that, um... I forget what I'm supposed to do to make him get off. Brown, you're yelling. Oh, I'm not yelling. I'm gonna play this tactically. Just gotta get a nice stab in and move. Duck and weave, boys. Duck and weave. Ooh, no, he missed. Get him. Get him. <gasps> are you okay, bro? What are you doing? Oh, I thought that he was getting attacked. Oh, yeah? Should I just leave? I'm just like, well, whatever, I'm out of here, boys. Oh, there's more. Hey, where's Brown going? Oh, there's quite a few of them. There's a few of these boys. You alright, Brown? You look like you're taking the brunt of the force. Get off me. 
I will stab a bitch if I have to. Oh, I do a little cub stomp attack as well. How sad you must be, little little man, to be fucking cub stomped by the most in like, the weakest woman ever. Look at her. She's hella weak. Oh, you're still alive? Get sliced. Oh, I can't even know. Cub stomp. Dead. Okay. So what should I do now? Um, I have the butterfly now. That's right. I can just go to... Um, I can just go and hand it in now. That is what I shall do. Let's get the hell out of here. Come on, brownie boy. Oh, there's more. Maybe I can just walk past them. It's not like I actually have to kill them. Yep. Not an issue. Oh, you think that you're great, but you're shit. Wait a minute. This doesn't feel like the right way. Actually, yes, it is. It's the correct way. I know exactly where I'm going now. Getting juke today. Juked. Oh, that guy got me. Good one. Oh, that's a rat. Would you get off my feet, damn it? Get, get, get away from me. Is that another rat? It is. What's up with that? That's pretty creepy. Looks like we did it. We got away with murder. Mwah. God, if they're in here... Ah, oh, they're not. Okay. She was sucked in. She was eaten by the door. Alright. Well, I've got your blue butterfly. Nothing happened. Oh. Whoops. Make an offering. This is what I would like to offer. I hope you enjoy it. I don't know. Why not? Oh. It's her first time. Yeah, she's new. So, pass? Oh, I did it. Hell yeah. I call that a victory. Gentlemen, welcome to the Aristocrat Club. Thank you all for gathering here today. Oh God, what a swanky girl. Disgrace. Nothing worse than nothing. Your gift is worth nothing. What 
a bitch. Amanda. Passed out from that? It's just a little mouse thing. It could be cute in a way. You could be like, oh, it's touching my face. But I guess not. When the unlucky girl awoke, she was back in the strange room. The boy in white clothes looked down with knowing eyes and spoke to her. Well, do you remember now what a bad girl you were? You haven't gotten your memory back, have you? Well, you've really done many, many bad things. You'll just have to remember them little by little. And when you fully remember what a bad girl you were, this game will end. Now take your stupid dog and continue with our little game, dear Jennifer. <laughs> oh, right, that's the boy who we chased from the bus. What a little bitch. May 1930, Sir Peter. Hmm. Oh, wow. It appears we're back in the film. <laughs> Well, Brown, at least we get another month to live, right? That's what I think. Alright, guys, and well, we're back in the filth room, so I'm all out of time for this episode, so I'd like to thank you all for watching. Once again, another weird turn of events. Um, so, if you guys are enjoying this episode, I really hope that... You are. That right doesn't make much sense, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. So, I'll see you guys in the next piece of shit that I upload. So, stay tuned. For more.